Welcome to the journey. Today we're gonna to go over how to improve your digital storytelling using Instagram stories. All right, Emma, so tell us all, why is Instagram so important? Well, first off, there's a billion active monthly users on Instagram. Wow. And you might be thinking, okay, cool, but how does this relate to my business? Right. Well, 70% of the consumers there, they're searching for a business and 80% are following a business like yours. Wow. So are you on there? Are you? Let us know in the comments below. Tell us more. How can we really utilize Instagram and Instagram stories for our business? Yeah, so the in the moment content is really what I get excited about when it comes to Instagrams for businesses like yours. Mm -hmm. And what's really cool about in the moment content, Instagram stories, is that you can get a really authentic feel for your business. So just think about it. Like you have stuff going on all the time, whether you are in the auto repair shop, right. making pastries in the bakery, or you're getting someone's hair done, right? You, you're giving a balayage before and after shots. Yeah. Giving some behind the scenes, it's gonna give you an authentic feel and mm. look for your business. And that's what we want, especially millennials. Yep, tell us some of the content that we can really create inside of Instagram. Yeah, so really embracing the in the moment content. We're talking videos, boomerangs. Also, you can use customer testimonials that you've mm. already received. That's right. great. It's Good word of mouth. Yeah. Another one besides boomerangs and video content is yeah. pay attention to when your customers tag you. They're already that at your business. Huge. They're a huge fan. And then when they tag you, not only are they giving you great advertising, word of mouth, right. and it's free, but then you can repurpose it, reshare it. There's your content for the day. And that's user generated content. And if you want to know a little bit more, check out this video and we go in depth and even dive in. <laughs> that's true. All right, Emma, so give us some best practices. Give us a lowdown on using Instagram stories. Totally, so definitely wanna be consistent with font and color. Okay. Also, be sure to tag your location. I mean, this is great to get more exposure. I know when we were out here in yeah. Kirkland and Seattle, and we started doing some behind the scenes for the journey. <laughs> some BTS. Some BTS. I actually <laughs> tagged the location and it helped quadruple my views. So be sure to do that as a business. Tag your location and tag the people who are also in the video. So other thing that's really fun to leverage on your Instagram stories, stickers. So you can oh, have stickers. a ton of fun. You can add GIFs, you can add music. And think about how that would bring things to life. You could do, back to the pastry example, in the bakery, whipping things up, add an 80s song to that. Right. You might even reach a whole nother target audience, which could be customers of yours down the road. And it just makes your content just more fun, brings it to life, which is what is important. Absolutely. And it's fun, which you know we lecture on this. <laughs> <laughs> Don't forget to have fun when you are on social media for your business. All right, that's a wrap. You just learned how to improve your digital storytelling with Instagram stories. Make sure to like and comment on your favorite tip below. Subscribe to the channel. Ring that bell if you want to see these first. But before we end this, let's create some behind the scenes content right now. Instagram stories. Let's, let's do go. it.